Hi guys, I just wanted to do a little video here on my brand new 10 megahertz GPS DO double oven oscillator here. Uh, it puts out a one pulse per second square wave clock signal, as you can see here, and also puts out a 10 megahertz. sine wave. Uh, if I could get it plugged in here. Cool, huh? Ah, that, that down there, this is probably the oscilloscope off, not the actual 10 megahertz GPS DO, but, uh, yeah, so that's that. Uh, I compared this next to a atomic clock for about 10 or 12 hours, and it held time. Well, the actual, the one pulse per second, it held time fairly well, but it was jumping around a little bit. And I'm pretty sure that's due to the power supply, since the power supply that it came with is this thing right here. This little uh, 12 volt, 1 amp power supply. And I was thinking about switching to a analog power supply or something else. Um, to get a good signal. I haven't tried the RS-232 coming out of here yet. Uh, the only problem I really have with it is that uh, the power jack is on the front and there's no plug-ins for 10 megahertz on the back. So yeah, that's that. Pretty cool gonna use it for some stuff well first uh, uh, I was gonna use it to stabilize some of my radios and uh, get better signals because uh, the clock signal on my radio moves around over a long period of time is kind of annoying uh, also gonna use it for a few other projects that I have going on including a router with, that's going to act as a NTP server. So that's going to be a lot of fun. Yeah. Held, it holds uh, time against the atomic clock on the 10 megahertz. It's right there. And it's really nice. Once you unplug the GPS antenna, however, it drifts a little bit. But it could hold probably within a few microseconds well, for a week or so I have to guess but yeah oh thanks for watching